Hey guys, I'm Isaac Jarnigan. Welcome back to another video. I'm an entrepreneur, podcaster, content creator. If you want to learn more about me, all my links are in the description, newsletter, podcast, daily content, all that crap. Today, I want to talk to you about how we can turn your audio from this kind of sort of audio, not very good, right? To this audio. Now, as you can see, I'm not using my mic today. As you can see, my sound is not coming from here. I'm simply using my laptop mic today, but let's get over to my computer screen so we can get started. I'll show you two ways to do this, but the first way to access this tool, we're gonna go to the internet, we're gonna search up Adobe. Let me search it right for you instead of the way I always search it. Audio enhance, we're gonna go search, um, and you are gonna see the Adobe official site, that's sponsored, that's sponsored, and then here we go. Adobe podcast, enhance speech from Adobe. This is an online tool that you drag in your MP3 files, and it's a beautiful thing. It, again, you heard the audio, it just improves it tremendously. You will need to make an Adobe account to use this, so go ahead and do that, and then you'll be good to go. As you can see, I've used this recently, but I'm gonna show you what I do. One of the reasons I use this tool to give you some inspo is for my podcast. So I'm gonna take a segment from the podcast. Ben's mic wasn't too bad, which was the guest I interviewed this last one. Sometimes guests don't come with the best audio setup, and I don't expect them to. I don't wanna talk to them because of their audio. I wanna talk to them for what they have to say. Um, so I use this tool every episode. Um, I get, you have to get an MP3 file for it to work. And so this is how I export an MP3 file. If you use Adobe Premiere Pro, you just go from H.264 and then you change it to MP3 and then you export your selected frame. I can't think of every way to get an MP3 or a file to an MP3 file. So you'll have to do some of that on your own. But once you have that file, it's as simple as dragging and dropping. So I'm gonna drag this file, which I just exported to here. And then you're gonna see it's gonna upload and enhance. Another reason you could use this as more of a content creator is that you don't have audio equipment. You don't have a microphone um, and you want some solid audio. Uh, just drag this in or maybe you make a mistake with someone and your audio turned out terrible. And so you have to correct it. I've used this tool to correct it. I use this tool a lot. Maybe you're a college student and you have to record a two to three minute intro video about yourself for your class and you got to record it. Um, this could be soothing to your professor's ears, you know, I'll just use it for whatever advantage you want. Now that it's enhanced, you can kind of listen through it or whatever. Um, you can enhance it as much as you want or as little as you want. But I kind of noticed if you go anything above 90, it's too strong. And then if you do anything below this, it makes it sound weird. And I'll just say soapy. I don't know why I want to say that, but I'm going to say it. But we'll just go to that. I need Mark. We'll download it. We'll drag it to the correct segment that I highlighted. As you can see, I already did this for this episode. Did it again for this. Beautiful stuff. That is how you do it on a computer. If you need any extra help, uh, give me a message. I'd, I'd be glad to look into that for you. Maybe. Probably. But if you're on Premiere, uh, they literally just took this out of beta. And you can do it in Premiere Pro now, which is Adobe's editing app. The same people that make Photoshop and all that crap. So... To do that, you're gonna click on the audio file you wanna mess with. You're gonna go sound, you're gonna go dialogue, and then you're just gonna press enhance. It's the same exact tool, it's just natively. Now, I almost use the online one just cause I'm so used to it and there's no cap as of right now, I believe. Um, but uh, maybe I'll look into using this. It is the no brain, brainless way to make your audio sound professional without doing any work or spending the three, 400 bucks you can on an audio setup. So definitely give that a shout. Like I said, I'm Isaac Jarnigan. I'm always trying to give out tips like this, build a little community online, say what's up, network with some new people. Uh, would encourage you to check out my links below, newsletter, podcasts, weekly YouTube videos, daily content. Always here to say hi. Uh, appreciate you all. Peace and love and tranquility, baby.